This video will show you how to add users with fob cards and pin codes using Smart PSS. Once you have Smart PSS open, go ahead and select Access. Now select User. And then Manual Add. Give the user an ID and a name. For this, we'll just do test fob. And then from here, under card number, you can either use an external USB reader or an actual door reader. So for here, select device, and then you could select the door. Then present the fob to that reader that's on the selected door. The card number will appear. Then we'll go ahead and select finish. And now we'll head over to access control and give this user privileges. So access control and then user right. And by default, there is a 24 hour uh, full access. So that's what we'll select here under select door group. And then OK. So that just pushed that information to the board and now that user I will not have access and we'll show you once we present the card. So if you go under console you can actually see and monitor what's going on at the door. So you see the, um, the fob took and it unlocked the door. Okay so now we'll show you how to add a, a keypad user. So we'll go back to user. Again we'll go to manual add. Give the user an ID, make sure it's different than what you already used. So we'll use two for this. And for the name, we'll just do test pin. And for this, you have to enter a card uh, issuer and manually enter your uh, pin under card number. And then also enter that same pin under unlock password. And then finish. And the same thing we did last time, we'll go back to access control, go to user right, select operation on that user, and then we'll use the default setting of all day permission, select the box there, and then OK. That'll push the information to the board. And then we'll go back to console, and I'll enter the pin at the door. And as you can see, the test pin just came through and it unlocked the door. So that's how you enter FOB users and PIN code users using SmartPSS on our Elite Series Access Control Board. Thank you for watching.